Hey guys, welcome back to Woody's Sound Up. My name's Woody. Uh, be sure to follow me here and on my Instagram page at Woody's underscore Sound Up, where I showcase the best home theater, gaming, and two channel setups and products from around the world. And today I just wanted to give you guys a quick little video. I was sent over a little uh, care package from my friends at Suell. Um, they make some really nice high quality cables and connectors, um, really all kinds of stuff. Uh, check them out at SuellDirect.com. Uh, you can find them on Amazon and uh, just all over the internet. Um, but today, they sent me over their cool new uh, right angle banana plug kits. Uh, so this is the silverback um, line, and these guys are the deadbolt. A uh, little bit different in construction, uh, but you should be getting about the same quality on both of them. Um, just a little, little nicer, complete look on the uh, on the silverbacks. Um, so if you've never used uh, banana plugs before, they're very easy to assemble. Um, there shouldn't really be any difference in quality, uh, positive or negative. Uh, it's mostly just a convenience, whether it's your speakers or your equipment, um, whether you just need, um, whether you're just in a tighter space, um, you know, you have surround speakers closer to a wall, um, something like that. It's just going to give you, um, you know, an easier time with that. And then the right angle will let you get even closer to the wall, uh, without, without obstructing the wall, without hitting the wall. Um, and to me, another added benefit um, would be if you have kids or animals or something like that that tends to get behind your speakers. Um, I think the right angle is just gonna be a little more, more secure um, than the classic straight uh, banana plug um, where your speaker wires are gonna stick out more. Um, so if kids or animals are hitting on them, um, where these guys, like I said, they'll just give you a straight, straight up and down. So you're going to have a lot less, uh, less to worry about there. Um, so like I said, really easy to use. Um, so let's just check it out real quick. So as you know, a uh, typical speaker wire, you'll usually just loosen up the uh, binding post, strip your wire to expose the copper, you know, cram it down there and then tighten it up. Um, sometimes depending on wire gauge, it can get a little janky, uh, trying to get your wire at the right angle and get it into the, uh, into the hole and then tightening it back down. Um, and then you do also have the, uh, the possibility of your wires touching, um, or just frayed wires just sticking out and, uh, it's just kind of a mess. Um, so these guys just really clean that up and, uh, and just make it a lot easier, especially if you're swapping speakers, if you're swapping equipment, um, if you ever have to service anything, uh, it's just so much easier um, than unscrewing, pulling your speaker wire out, doing what you need to do, you know, fishing your speaker wire back in, tightening it back up, you know, with a good banana banana plug, you simply just plug it, plug it straight into the back of your speakers. Um, just about every speaker, uh, every piece of equipment these days should have uh, banana plug capable binding posts. Um, sometimes they are hidden under like the uh, clips reference from here. Um, as an example, they're actually hidden under a, uh, a colored cap on the end, which I've seen a lot of people online comment that, you know, oh, the clips reference from here can't use banana plugs. Um, you simply just have to take a knife, pry out the little black cap that, or the uh, black or red cap that's on the end, and then you can use your banana plugs. Um, so, like I said, two different options here. They go together a little bit different. Um, so first you have the deadbolt, and then you have the silverback, which the silverback is uh, so well as top of the line. Um, not much difference in price. I believe they are only a dollar or two difference for the for the packs. Um, and so let me just show you really quick how they work. Uh, here I have some Swell Silverback speaker wire. This is a 12 gauge high strand um, oxygen free copper. Um, so we're just going to strip an end here. And then we expose, expose our wire. And now for the deadbolt, all you're going to do is these guys are going to unscrew. 
There you go. And you'll have just kind of a little barrel there. And then you will just put your speaker wire up through. And then you'll get some speaker wire out, out the top. And then you'll just kind of fold it down over Fold it down over the the sides of the uh, the top, and then simply take the uh, take the top, screw it on, and then when it screws on, it's going to apply force to that, and it's just going to make it nice, nice and tight, nice and secure. That's not coming off, and you should never have to worry about that ever breaking loose or coming off or anything like that. Um, and like I said. Behind your equipment, it's going to be a lot nicer, in my opinion, than the uh, than the classic straight straight binding post or straight banana plug that's going to push your wire out, um, and then it makes it a little bit more susceptible to, like I said, kids getting back there, animals getting back there, um, and banana clips can tend to be a little more fragile, so you definitely don't want something hitting on those. And then with the uh, right angle. Just pop it right in and look at that, it holds pretty pretty nice and snug to the speaker. So that's uh, pretty cool right there. Um, so like I said, the um, silver back is a little bit different construction. Um, you will see in the kit included right there is a little tiny flathead screwdriver. Kind of cool, they also made it look like the uh, like the banana plugs. So you will remove the barrel, same way, just unscrew it. And then you're going to expose two little tiny screws. Now you're just going to back the screws out with the included screwdriver. And you can look down inside the barrel to see and make sure you're just going to want them to back out enough to fit your speaker wire down there so so I'll just back them all the way out until they're flush with the uh, with the barrel just so you're not getting them snagged up on their way in so a little bit more work here but not too much all right so I'm nice and clear and now I'll do the same thing I will strip my speaker wire so my wire is stripped there so once your wire is nice and stripped you're going to want to take the screw on barrel and you're just going to slide it down the speaker wire just to have it ready uh, for when the actual connection is on um, so now like I said twist up your speaker wire uh, you know, just make it nice and nice and stiff. You know what, I'm, you know what I mean. And then uh, you're just gonna slide that guy right in there. This video is getting out of control right now. Um, and then you will just tighten the little screws down onto the speaker wire. And you're gonna tighten it until the screws are completely flush with the barrel. Now this one fell out, so I gotta start it back in. Not too bad, there we go. All right, so you'll see it's nice and tightened. Uh, the screws are, you know, just about flush there. And then you'll simply slide that guy back over Screw it back on until it's nice and snug, and there you go. And same thing, uh, it's going to give you that nice, clean connection. Um, and the uh, the barrels are 24 karat gold plated. Um, They're copper construction, uh, so you shouldn't have any any problems with uh, quality or connection or anything like that, you're gonna have a nice good connection between your speakers and your equipment. And like I said, it's just gonna be more convenience, um, but it is very nice just if, like I said, you're ever swapping out equipment, um, you're swapping amplifiers, or you just wanna dress up your equipment and uh, 
you know, have it if you ever do need to move it in the future. Uh, I think banana plugs are just a nice, nice feature to have, um, a nice accessory to have uh, in your system. And like I said, to me, another another big benefit is just how flat it keeps the wires against the back of your speaker there. Um, for if you're ever, uh, you know, having kids running around or animals running around, um, I think it just sits a lot better than than uh, than the speaker wire kind of jutting out of the out of the back like this would be. Um, so you can see how much more, you know, those kind of add to it. Um, not a deal breaker by any means. I mean, those are still great. Straight banana plugs are still still a nice convenience. But to me, I just feel like the uh, right angles are just a little bit more secure and uh, kind of take a little bit of stress off of knowing that someone might not hit those on the backside and, and break a banana plug off inside your... Uh, in your plugs there so so very cool um, like I said pretty pretty cost effective um, under 20 bucks for for a pack so if you're gonna do you know a full system you know you might need a couple packs but really not that that bad and then uh, you just pick up a nice you know 14 12 gauge speaker wire 16 whatever you need um, and uh, you're gonna have a nice uh, nice speaker wire there so again soildirect.com and these are the silverback right angle banana plugs and these are the deadbolt right angle banana plugs so be sure to check them out and uh, we'll see you guys on the next video thanks for watching